All right, everybody, just a real quick uh, video on how to get a lot of enzymes. Now, I talked about this in my last boosting video, so if you want to know how to boost fields without wasting too many resources in mid-game, then check out my video. Uh, link is nowhere in the description box because I'm probably way too lazy to add it to it. But, 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 I'm going to show you something. So, I always have enzymes and there's a reason for it and I'm gonna tell you how I do it so um, you will require a few things I mean these things are all optional you know they are all optional but um, if you're an early game player then uh, it's gonna be a bit difficult because the thing you need is the pineapple patch you have to be good on the pineapple patch now there are a few things that you need to be good on the pineapple patch now for me personally the gummy mask is really good because the gummy mask gives me uh, I can show you here uh, we have times uh, 1.25 white pollen 25 percent pollen uh, we have white field uh, capacity we have a lot of white field stuff in there which is really really good now now, where is my, uh, let me quickly see, beekeeper boots, bee pollen, cobalt guard, amulet, oh, that's the supreme, yeah, king beetle amulet, honeycomb belt, beekeeper boots, where is it, where you at, bronxes, stick amulet, crimson guard, moon amulet, I can't find it, but anyways, uh, the backpack, the good old backpack here, is it in here, no, it doesn't actually give me the stats, why not, where is it? Am I stupid? Anyways, um, it also gives me some white field boosts, which is very nice. Um, and now, the one of the biggest important, most important things is, let me show you this, is uh, the moon amulet, which is right over here. The moon amulet, uh, where's my moon amulet? There it is. Gives me 250,000 capacity, so that's what you should aim for, you know. Always buy until you have 250,000 capacity, because that's max. You cannot have more. Now, 4% bond from treats is, meh, you know, <laughs> not necessarily the craziest. But I have a pineapple patch boost times 113%, which is really good. Now, I'm obviously trying to go for more. You can get up to 150%. And and uh, I'm going to try this actually in this video. Let's see if we can get... Now, this is actually also pretty good if you get white uh, pollen. Uh, that can go up to 50%. Uh, if you have a mixed hive, it's really good. But I'm going to just try to see 36%. That's not too bad. 70% uh, pollen from bees. But we still want that. I want the pineapple patch. I need the... Um, oh, bond from battle. That's probably not too bad either. But I'm going to go for uh, the... Buh, 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 buh. But as you can see, it's very difficult to get. <laughs> Already wasted all of my moon charms. It's like 500 moon charms wasted. Uh, it's really hard to get. Um, but if you get it, definitely keep it. If you want to do the technique that I'm showing you here right now. So do that. And you will get 113% boost on pineapple patch. It's important to make the pineapple patch one of your most uh, or one of your best patches or fields in the game to farm on. It's actually my best field. Now... <clears throat> Also, um, getting uh, satisfying nectar is really important. Now, check out the, the boost you have here. That's the red bee uh, convert rate. You have a white pollen times 1.9 1, 1 white pollen. That's actually so good. Times 145 honey at hive, blah, blah, blah. But you need the white pollen boost. And it can only be given by the satisfying nectar. So that's really good. Now, if you go onto the field, you will just have to farm, man, like I did. Just farm a lot, do a lot of farming, you know, uh, try to um, get as many, just, just do your normal out of farm. You can see the pineapple spawning here all the time uh, because you just don't want to farm. I mean, obviously, most of this stuff is, um, you know, optional. If you don't have the money yet to get all of this stuff that I have, then you can just farm on the pi pineapple patch because you will need those pineapples for the crafting materials. But the better tip and trick is if you work towards uh, having the pineapple patch actually uh, be your best field in the game, then you actually have a reason to farm on here every day. And that's how you actually build i mean just look at this look at this look at this this is so good this is so good we got so many pineapples coming in here right now and i just actually have to be on the field right now i'm not doing too much because i'm not collecting any things and i'm not running any boost but usually i can make to two to three million every second on this field if i actually you know farm like hardcore as you can see so let's boost it up 
and we're on 2 million now and sometimes it goes to 3 sometimes it goes to 4 million depends on the boost on the field um, yeah so it's a really good field for me um, I can farm a lot on here and I get like 24,000 something uh, in enzymes now you uh, in pineapples you only need pineapples and uh, royal jellies now royal jellies by now you should know on how and where to get them as you can see here I'm peaking almost to 3 million a second which is really good I mean like I said it's not necessarily purely end game yet but it's certainly going that way at one point um, it's a really good field for me so uh, yeah if you don't know how to get royal jellies I'm gonna quickly show you we uh, you can go here by the time now where you actually need some stuff you can get the royal jellies here and um, the good thing is that they cap at a specific amount of number here about amount of money so it doesn't get more expensive like with the ticket uh, place up there you know at mountaintop or something so that's my play uh, that's my uh, my play <laughs> that's my plan on getting the most uh, enzymes you know uh, in the crafting materials uh, yeah basically you go into the thingy then into the blender over here you put it in you know and then you get your stuff but I, th I think I have something in there let's see yeah I have something in there so that's about it everybody thank you very much for watching and I will see you in the next video goodbye